Welcome to our wholesome horrors. I'm Economicon, and today we've been playing for the game Before We Go, which shows the situation of two friends who are about to graduate high school and now have one last night at prom together before they go their separate ways. And have a good prom night tomorrow, everyone. Have a good summer, Miss Nora. Finally, you're there. God, I thought this lesson would never end. Hey, relax, it's summer, right? You guys can just relax now and... Oh, you got kicked out of class. How did you manage to get kicked out of class on our very last day? Well, you know me. Always gotta break those records. Only reckon you'll achieve, dude. Better than nothing, I guess. Uh, anyway. How about going to the river tomorrow morning? We could hang out before we go to prom. Yeah, of course. I'm down. Perfect, then. Now, let's rub that vending machine one last time. So, do we want to rub it? You know, I'm not sure we should do it, but you know what? If you can do it. You actually never told me how you make it work without coins. That's because I'm trying to protect you from becoming a very dangerous delinquent. Ah, like you, you mean? Exactly, like me. Well, you know what, at least he owns it. Okay, it's done. Do you want something now, bro? Uh, do we want chips or Coke? Always the answer is Coke. Coke! Oh, so you're an outlaw after all. Yep, we both are so. Thank you, Thief. Thief! I mean, you're the one that announced you were going to break into it. Why are you so surprised about the word? And, um, I was thinking about something. Uh, do, do we want to be the sass one? I kind of want to be sassy. Oh, because you can actually think. Interesting. You're hilarious, Lucas. Hilarious. No, but seriously, isn't it funny that our skin patterns actually match? Uh, what do you mean? Look at us. You have circles, I have dots, and they're exactly at the same spot on our skin. I mean, isn't that really surprising? Would that not just be like regular skin patterns for frogs? Isn't it kind of like freckles? Like, generally speaking, a lot of them are situated over the top of the cheeks, over the nose. Am I might think about this all wrong. Uh, huh? Oh, uh, what? How did I not realize this before? Do you know what it means? No. I think. I think maybe. We were meant to meet. Something out there. Fate. Destiny. Call it whatever you want created that link between us. We're bound to each other. Oh, Ezra, you're a giant softy. Imagine if that was true. Wow, imagine if that was actually true. I'm serious, Luke. Somehow I know life will always bring us back to each other. Oh, um, partners in skin then. Partners in skin. Watch out! Wait. Okay, wait, wait, what are you doing? Wait, let me go. Atomic bomb! Ta da! Do people actually shout atomic bomb with a cannonball? <laughs> I've never heard that. Damn. Damn, Ez. Haven't I told you to be careful? I was right under you. Aw, oh, poor little thing. I didn't know you were so fragile and weak. I therefore deeply apologize for my misbehavior. Get revenge. We must always get revenge. Who are you? I'm this town's sheriff, and my job is to get rid of criminals. Die, dangerous man. Atomic bombs aren't allowed in here. Ah, you got me, sheriff. I... Of course I got you. Who did you think I was? Justice ain't gonna dispense itself. So, how'd I do? We 
what do you mean? How did you do? What, in the atomic bomb? I'd give you a solid 4 out of 10. I've seen better. How good was I pretending your muscular is strong enough to beat me? I take it back. You get a 2 for the atomic bomb now. I mean, we could say this, but... We know that's probably factually incorrect. I almost believed you. Pretty good, actually. I almost believed it. <laughs> I've always been a great actor. Come on now, Sheriff. Let's eat something. Um, I haven't bought anything to eat. Uh, I made us jam sandwiches. Yay, jam sandwiches. Thank you. Mm, Lucas, how do you feel about high school coming to an end tonight? I mean, hasn't it technically already come to an end? Or are you just holding off until prom is officially over? Uh, I don't know, really. It's weird. I'm not sure I've realised it yet. It feels like we're actually never going to leave. See, I found the weirdest thing with school is that when it was over, it didn't feel any different. I don't know if it was meant to, but honestly, it just... It feels the same. Yeah, bro, I quite agree. It feels like we'll be here for years. Swimming down the river and going to school every day. Damn, life is strange sometimes. Maybe that's the thing with life. Maybe it's always going to be ready before we are. Maybe we'll always have to adapt in order to follow its flow. But why does it have to be that way? Why can't we take time? Uh, because, well, life's never going to wait for us to be ready. Let's enjoy the last few hours we have together then. Yeah, let's do so. You know, Lucky, I'm actually really excited about prom. It's going to be best farewell one has ever seen. One will always remember. Mm. You'd rather not disappoint me. No, well, we're not going to be mean. He's being sentimental, so... Yeah, let's make the night unforgettable. Here we are, Luke. You, I, and the night. Yeah. Oh. It's gonna be... It's gonna be legendary. Come on now. Where are you taking me? Just follow me. There's something I want us to do tonight. Are we robbing another vending machine? Here we are. Take those. What do you expect me to do with a pen and a sheet of paper? I thought we could write a letter to our future selves. What do you mean? Am I supposed to write a letter to your future self or mine? Write to whoever you want. You do whatever you want tonight. It's our night, remember? I think I'll write to... Shh! Don't tell me now. Just write first. Write whatever comes to your mind. Okay, should we... Should... No, we'll write to Ezra. Why not? It feels more awkward than writing to ourselves. Hi, Ezra. It's me, Lucas. I hope you remember me. I'm not exactly sure what I should write in here, but I just want to be honest. Do you remember... Um... High school? High school like I do? I know I can be weird, assuming now that I'll remember everything perfectly, but I know I will. Everything I've never told you, I'll tell now. I've always had a hard time talking about how I truly feel deep inside, but I hope you'll know. Huh. Do we want to be in love with Lucas or not? What do we think? You know what? I will allow it. How in love I am with you right now. Maybe it's too late to say it. Maybe I should have said it sooner. Maybe I can still find strength to confess it to you tonight. But as you made me feel truly happy. As you're reading this, just know that no matter where I am on Earth right now, I still think of you. I still care, and I know I'll always do. I'll... Always be... Okay. Do we want to find you again? Well, we may not find him again someday. We'll be always there. That's what we'll be. I'll always be there if you need anything. Take care of yourself, Ezra. Um... Sure, we'll end with I love you. We've already said it once. I love you. 
Alright, I'm done. Yeah, me too. We both wrote to each other, right? <laughs> Correct. Let's open them in exactly five years from now. How does that sound to you? Honestly, if I was going to have a letter that I was going to open in five years, I I'm not even kidding. I would most likely lose that letter within that time. I am so utterly hopeless for things like that. Perfect. Oh, they're playing our song. Dude, come on, let's dance. We ain't gonna dance with Leapfrog. Sorry, I will leave now. He ran away, directly toward the crowd full of dancing students. I didn't move. I stood there and looked at him. His face was covered with joy and his smile was radiant. He turned around, threw me a glance beamed at me and beckoned me over with a wave. Happy and excited, I walked forward and joined him in the crowd. He smiled and started dancing. As I slowly moved my feet from side to side, my mind emptied and my heart lightened up. I stopped overthinking. It felt good. And at that exact moment, with him by my side, I understood how it feels to be alive. Damn, Lucky! That was one hell of a dance! Come now, let's go somewhere quieter! Ah, uh, exactly what I needed! Fresh air and shining stars! Hmm. Sure, you know what? Why not? I didn't know you were such a good dancer! Of course, I'm a good dancer! Should I remind you of who I am? Now that I think of it, tonight was the first time I ever saw you dance. I had to keep surprises to make tonight special. Hmm. You really- okay. You really wanted that night to be special, didn't you? Yeah? Yeah, I really did. You know, Lucas. I'm really going to miss you. I'm going to miss you too, Ezra. Can we promise we'll never forget each other? Mm, I promise. Well, I promise too. You know, I can't help but think about high school coming to an end. It feels like the death of something. The death of the period of life in which... Mm, life is easy and comforting, that's the one. In which life was easy and comforting. And I'm so scared that if our high school ever dies, our memories will die with it. It doesn't mean it's the end. It only means that we're going forward with our lives. But all of those moments between us reveal, and they'll always be ours. Hmm. Do we? Are we gonna chicken out? You know what? He could just take it as a friend. Why not? I love you, S. I know it's dumb, but I wanted to say it before. I love you too, Luke. Always did, always will. It's so relieving to finally hear it. I kind of knew, but to hear you actually say it, it is relieving. Well, you're welcome. Um? Um, wh what happened to our Ezra? Have you multiplied? You seem to be blushing behind yourself. It's, it's fine. It's fine. We're gonna move on. That's the last gift you'll get from me before a very long time. So take good care of it. Take good care of mine too. I'll see what I can do. Tell me, as Hmm? Will we find each other again? Someday. Hey, we're partners in skin, remember? Fate has our back, I'm sure we will. Okay, um... Yes, that one sounds nicer. I'll try to trust life for once then. Just wait, you'll see. I wish... I wish tomorrow would never come. If only I'd forget you with one last dance. Things would be so much easier. But you're everywhere in my heart. And I know you'll always be. Wanna give it a try? 
forget with a dance. As soon as he finished talking, we quietly got up. He grabbed my waist, I put my hands around his neck, and for the first and last time, we slow danced. He looked at me with his golden, tearing eyes and vainly tried to smile. My heart sank in my chest and my cheeks became wet. It was the last time I ever saw him. But we're partners in skin. And somehow, I know we'll find each other again. Well, I hope you enjoyed that playthrough before we go, when we deal with the horrors of life changing all around us. But if you need to prepare for what comes next in maybe college, then I highly recommend you check out BSc and BS and prepare you for what you may experience when writing your thesis. As always, if you enjoyed your time here, then please like this video and subscribe to this channel to stay up to date. But other than that, hope you have a spooky day and I'll catch you next time, guys.